Prince of Fatima served as the Bishop of the Diocese of Altoona, Johnstown from 1987 to 2011. People I spoke with at today's viewing say there were financial hardships and other issues during the tenure of Joseph Adamak, but they hope people remember the good he brought to the community. Candles were lit. The organ played. <laughs> Prayers recited. <laughs> and a spot in a front pew of the Cathedral of the Blessed Sacrament left empty. All to honor Bishop Joseph Adamat. Patty and Joe Fromnet started attending the Diocese of Altoona Johnstown when they moved here in 1995. They say Bishop Adamak wasn't just there for you on Sundays, but also during the week, like when he came to watch their son in a school play. It was touching that he took the time out to come and watch the kids and, and participate in, in that way. It was, it, we found him very devoted. Tony DeGaulle worked with Adamac for two years. He says the bishop started many ministries that are still thriving today. However, his reputation was tarnished following his alleged involvement in covering up the child sex abuse scandal within the church. Of course, it was highlighted in the grand jury report in 2016. And I know that there are many people who are still hurting today. Patty says she hopes the community doesn't let that time overshadow the help Adamek brought to the community. I, w I wish we could all remember all of the good. And, and there's a lot of good there that unfortunately has been tainted. There will be another viewing for Bishop Adamak here at the Cathedral of the Blessed Sacrament on Tuesday morning at 10, followed by a funeral mass at 11. In Altoona, David Kaplan, WTAJ News.